welcome back to another planning life with Erin. I am Erin and in this video I'm going to be planning in my happy planner dashboard layout. I use this for um, all things social media and also to track my Poshmark sales. Um, so I'm having difficulties deciding what stickers I want to use. I'm going to be completely honest with you. Um, I've been kind of going through some old stickers um, and I've also been doing a lot of printables lately so that's what kind of made me go back into um, older stickers that I haven't used in a while. Um, so yeah, I don't, I don't know where I was going with that. Sorry. So what I'm thinking is it's going to be a mixture of things. So I have my red lyric girls. I haven't used them in a while and I really love this girl. She's very summery and I love the planners and the pens of this one. I don't necessarily like this girl that much. Um, so I think I am going to add this girl in for sure. So we're gonna start with that. Um, also, I found, and I didn't use this on my other, I was gonna use it in my big, because I found this little, I don't know what it came with. It might've been with like a happy box or something. I don't know, I don't even know. I have so many stickers. I don't even know where they came from. Anyways, so I was gonna use this before in my big, um, but then I didn't really see anything that went with the theme that I was doing. Um, but I do like these. Like I like the be fearless in the pursuit of what sets your whole, your soul on fire. Um, so I think I'm going to bring in these. I also like this, be not afraid of going slowly, be afraid only of standing still. Um, I'm not sure if I want to use these, um, cause they don't, I don't know if they necessarily will look good with it. Maybe we'll see. Um, let's see. There are far far better things ahead than any we leave behind that one's nice all we have to do is decide all we have to decide is what to do with the time that is given to us i like this one a lot but i think i might save this one for my hourly because i like that have courage to follow your heart and intuition i like that one too so i think it's pretty safe to say we're probably going to use a couple of these quotes now, originally I was going to go with some pink boxes for this spread, but I don't know if it's going to be too much with the pink of this dress. So now I'm starting to kind of rethink that one also. Um, I've been trying to get into some yellow. So let's see how this mustard gold looks. I don't know. I look terrible. Maybe we'll add this in. This one's going to be a little too bright for me. There's a little softer one in here. Hmm. See, I'm very indecisive today. I don't know what I want to do. Let's just get planning, guys. Let me get my wax paper and we'll see where this takes us. So, where I want to start this week. If you guys saw my last video. I did a little, a little different in my dashboard. Nothing crazy, but I added a long box here. And I think I want to do that again. So let's try. I do like this mustard color. And I think I'm going to go with it. I want to add it in here. I don't have to do some whiting out. So I do like that there. And let's add in, let's see, I like this girl. I don't want to do that because I don't want to have too much of the, the space on the side. So let's add her in here. And then we'll put the quote. Okay. I guess I'm not super indecisive today. This, <laughs> this white out correction tape is driving me mad. I'm just saying. I don't know if it's me or if it's the actual correction tape, but I do need to get something different. This one I do like. And normally I don't like to use too much correction tape on this. I don't like how it looks, um, but we're gonna cover that. So I don't have to worry about it. All right, so I'm gonna take this girl off. Hopefully she didn't stick on there too too much. Okay. So I want to make sure I get this box on straight. Let's get this out of the way. I'm starting to kind of come up with a formula, I guess, for 
what has been working in my dashboard. And let me tell you, it has taken a while. So I think I got the dashboard layout. Mm. Oh, darn things. Uh, let's see, we're in July. I want to say I got it maybe January or February because I thought, well, that's pretty close to what I used to use. Um, why wouldn't I love it? But then I found that it couldn't be as free. I don't know if I got that on a straight. That's good enough. Um, I couldn't be as free with my decorative things that I wanted to do. So I was getting frustrated and I ended up going back to the vertical and using this to track certain things like my social media and Poshmark. And it's been working out really great. Um, Up. Words are difficult today. Sorry, I was I'm distracted. Okay, so it was working out really good. Um, it has been fantastic, but I'm trying to come up with some sort of a system so it kind of goes a little bit, um, not necessarily faster, but so I have everything I need um, to keep me on track. And sometimes I want to go in and add some things that I might have missed or I might need more boxes or whatever. So I'm feeling like I'm kind of coming up with a system now of what are must haves for my dashboard. I think that was a really long explanation, sorry. It's been a long day. But I wanted to decompress a little bit and there is nothing better then doing some planning and decompressing a little bit. You agree? Let me know. I can't be the only person. All right, that's cute. I like that. Now, I think that I'm probably going to add in some of these pink boxes also, just to break it up a little bit. And now, for this long strip, I'm gonna use this for my Monday through Saturday to write out what is going to be posted and when, so I don't um, lose track of it. This area isn't really necessarily big enough for me, so I'm liking this. Now, I wanna add in some pink. Let's see what pink would work with this. This one looks good. So let's go with this, this darker one. I don't use the darker one nearly as much as I probably should. Now, I want to use one for tracking my Instagram growth because I kind of like start guessing like, oh yeah, I think I was at this number or same thing with YouTube. And I really have been noticing that, um, I don't remember completely. Um, so I want to make sure I'm getting better with writing down the weeks, like the start of the week. And I'm very close to hitting some milestones. So I'm pretty excited about that. And I have been growing pretty consistently, so I'm also excited about that. And I think I want to add in a section. So this will be for my tracking. And I want to add in a section for... That's cute. I want to add in a section for... Um... Oh my goodness, what was I going to say? For different... Um videos or posts, um, maybe time that I'm putting it up and how much engagement there is. And I know it's kind of technical, um, but I'm curious. Um, and also curious, let me know if there's anything else you guys want to see. Like I was planning on doing a um, YouTube video on my planner lineup. Um, that will be coming out in the next, I don't know, week or so. I have to record it still. So let me know if there's anything in particular you would like to see, because I'd love to hear from you. I think here we're going to add in that box that I was talking about. So how do I want to do this? I kind of like this box, and I know there's lines here, but let's see if I like that there, like that or here. 
I don't have any, I have another quote that I could add there. I don't want them to be super close to each other. I don't know, my instinct is telling me to put it there. And you know what, I don't really need to have, it's okay to have white space. Having white space is actually a pretty good thing. It gives me a little bit more room to write if I need to. So I'm gonna put that there and then I'm going to leave a spot. I'm gonna put a header in. I think I wanna do a header. I don't know how this is gonna look, might look weird. No, I think that looks good. And I have some of these still. She designed the life she loved. I do like this. And coincidentally, it actually, it matches. So where do we want to put it? Maybe here? I feel like it's a little close to that color. Or, um, yeah, that's gonna take up too much space there. So let's do a little combo. If I stuck this on there, kind of like that. Oops, if I did this. tucked it. I want to cover the A, so I'm trying to do this very carefully. And also, straight. Ooh, perfect. I love that. And then I'll have a header there. Um, and then we'll do, do I want to do another one here? and you have a get it done. Although the get it done, I'm just noticing, I could probably do that here, I wonder. Add some of this gold in. I think I'm gonna cover this July. And I did this in another spread and I'm totally okay with it. But I really wanna add some of this gold in. Ooh, nice, okay. I think I'm gonna leave this for now. I'm gonna leave it blank. I might fill in, we'll come back to it, but I might um, white out those lines. And I don't really necessarily like that, but let's do this instead. Once it dries, it should blend in a little bit better. Okay. I've been debating washi tape but we'll come back to that. Okay, so we're gonna move on to the next page. And I apologize, because I really do feel like I'm all over the place today. All right, so for here, I did like, have the courage to follow your heart and intuition. I like that a lot. So I think I wanna use that one. And I like this take time for reflection. But I definitely like this one. So let's pull this one and I might add in, I don't really have any other girls that match. I do have this one. She reminds me of Breakfast at Tiffany's and she is pretty. So maybe we'll add her in here. Okay, I think I do like that idea. So let's do it and then this way the pinks will be brought in on this page as well. So I'm gonna bring her over as close as I can and I'm going to end up cutting off some of her dress, but it's all right. Huh. All right, let's see if I get this on her straighter. I have faith. I like that. Okay. That is adorable. Let's put it with the other side. Let's see how it looks. All right. I'm liking that. Now, um, I do like this. Be afraid of going slowly. Be not afraid. Sorry. And I do want to put this in somewhere. I just don't know how because it is 
gold. So I'm not sure if it'll show up, but let's, let's keep going. All right. If I put something here, what do I want to put in here? I have a planner still and I have a pen. So let's see. That quote would look good there. Do I have anything else that would first drink the coffee, then do the things? Surely me. This one would look good also. I wonder if it would fit. I think it would. Hmm. I do like this. It's about the journey as much as the outcome. Uh, I have a black quote there. That one. All right, let's try. Let's see how this would look. I can get it off. Hmm. All right, I'm gonna take this off, make it a little easier. All right. Got my wax paper again. white out the days of the week and then maybe we add in let's see I guess this pen would go the closest match the best okay that looks good so let's take care of Monday through Sunday And we'll let that dry for a minute. Meantime, let's put some boxes down. So what size do I want to use? I think I want to use this size rectangle. And we'll add in this here. And we're going to do, we're going to alternate. I think Wednesday and, let's see. Friday and then Wednesday and Thursday I might do bullets. I like how that's been looking lately. All right, let's see. My pages are falling apart. I use, I think I use the pink one the most. All right, let's see. There we go. Let's see another page. All right, so we're going to add one in on Wednesday and Friday. We'll alternate and that works out good. So this way it's not pink right next to pink. Oh, that looks so cute. Okay, so let's do, I think this is dry enough. So we're gonna add this in and then we'll go and work on the bullets. You know what? I think I want to use these this time. This always throws me off. I think I'm gonna do a pink box down here. <clears throat> it's like I try to alternate, but then you can't quite alternate. Saturday is a good place to have a box. And then let's do,
gold checkbox check marks. I don't know what these are called. That didn't come out quite as straight as I wanted to see, but that's okay. I'm liking that a lot. I still have this quote. I feel like I could add it, but then it'll be right next to that. I want gold on gold. What if I added it? No, because then there's a quote right there. How about here? Because be not afraid of going slowly, be afraid of only standing still. And I feel like that kind of goes with tracking my social. I feel like I need something else here. I'm trying to just be okay with the, the space, but I don't think I'm okay. <laughs> so let's see what size I want to add in. I could always potentially add in, I guess like this color. Maybe we could add it in this way. To have an extra box. It's never a bad thing to have an extra writing space, although I don't think I want this size. So let's see. Maybe we want to do a square. do I have? I have some hearts so we can add those in just to kind of fill this in a bit. Okay and then even though these pens don't really match very well I feel like it might be okay. Add a little pop of color in. Mm, I don't think I like that so we're not gonna. Okay. Anything else in here that we might want to use? I don't like the stars. Some of these quotes are a little, a little too dark. This is pretty. If I add this in somewhere. That looks nice there. Add that in there. Let's see. What else do we have? Be happy. I like that. Let's have fun. It's not the right yellow, but it's pretty. Let's try this be happy. Let's add it in. Sometimes you just need a little sum to tie things in. Cute! Okay. I like that. It's very, um, how it's summery to me with the pink and the gold. I like it. All right, am I in frame? I'm in frame. All right, guys, that's going to do it for me today. I'm really liking how this came out. Um, I feel like even though I do struggle at times with my dashboard, I do feel like um, I've gotten better with strategically laying out what I need um, and having a nice balance of decorative yet functional. Because for me, um, I do need it to be functional. That's, that's for sure. But part of the enjoyment of doing all this is being able to relax and um, just kind of like zone out and be creative. So I still like the fact that I have the ability and I'm starting to kind of figure it out with the dashboard. Um, I'm not gonna lie, it hasn't been easy, but I think we're getting there. So with that, I'm going to say thank you so very much for spending some time with me today and planning with me. Um, if you guys have not hit that subscribe button yet, uh, please do so. And if you like this video, give it a like. And I hope to see you guys on the next one. Bye.